In this lesson, we'll take a look at batch rendering in V-Ray. You'll notice with this SketchUp model, we have two scenes already set up, Render Camera 1 and Render Camera 2. Now, whenever you have multiple scenes set up for different renders, rather than having to render one at a time, you can take advantage of the batch render feature in V-Ray. You'll notice in the toolbar here, the batch render tool is available to you once you have two or more scenes in SketchUp. Before we render though, let's go to the Asset Editor, and then under the Settings tab, we'll switch on the Progressive Mode, and we'll set the Quality High, and then flip out this menu here, and if you click on the Ray Trace, let's take advantage of the time limit here. So we'll check this on, and we'll set the time limit to two minutes. Then I'll close down the Asset Editor, and back over in SketchUp, we can go ahead and click on the Batch Render button. Now it'll ask us to specify the file name and where we want to save it, so click OK and then we can go ahead and name it and click Save. And V-Ray will begin the batch render. When your batch render is done, go ahead and take a look at where you saved the files and open them up to take a look. 